Hey there guys, welcome back to the MyGo YouTube channel. A very exciting light to review here. Really interested to see what it does. We've reviewed a light from Geek Light before and uh, Monster Board Pro and it was a very good fixture. I uh, was happy to recommend that. And they have a new one out. It's the Monster Board Pro 7200. And the big thing about this one is it's got lots of control around spectrum. So you can adjust UV, infrared, your veg and bloom stages and all that kind of stuff. So it'll be interesting to see how it performs. So this one is the 7200, as I said, which is the 720 watt model. And it's got three different boards, LED boards with heat sinks on the back. And then the drivers mounted on the back of those. And in this model, you've got one of the boards, the center one is the main one, or like the master one, and it controls the other ones as well. The other LED drivers empowers them. So you connect up to the main one and then uh, that, and connect subsequently to the two um, boards on the side. There are two other versions of the light, so you can get the 480 with, with two of these LED boards and the 240, which is just one of these LED boards. You can control multiple units at the same time using the Trollmaster system, so they're compatible with that, which makes it very handy for large installations. A big feature of this light is its um, spectrum control. As you can see here, you've got different switches for different stages of growth. You've got the VEG switch, which illuminates the white LEDs and has added blue LEDs to uh, increase the proportion of blue in the spectrum for short and dense growth during the VEG stage. And then you can switch it over into bloom for the flowering stage and the red LEDs come on, which are higher photosynthetic efficiency and will maximize the yield you can get in that, um, in that setting. You've also got two additional switches, one for infrared. Uh, they're difficult to see visibly now, but they're uh, infrared to add for the flowering stage of growth. And you've got UVA LEDs for the flowering stage of growth to try to uh, increase the uh, terpenes and the potency. The physical size of it is large. It's about a meter by a meter, about three and a half foot by three and a half foot, the fixture fits very well and gives a good spread into its chosen target area, which is a five foot by five foot or 1.5 meter by 1.5 meter area. And it delivers good power levels. So with the uh, switches on Bloom, it delivers an average power across the test area of 677 micromoles per meter squared per second. And it delivers over the um, 730 watts that it consumes it delivers an efficiency of 2.09 PPF per watt or usable PPF per watt. So pretty good system efficiency for a light which is as good value as this. So I like it. It's uh, simple in design in terms of the structure, but very easy to put together and very robust. You slide these three boards in onto these uh, beams on the end and just fix them into position. It's simple as that. Just connect up the uh, the three boards together, plug it in and you're ready to go. And uh, yeah, happy to recommend it. The link is in the description below. So the link direct to um, Geek Lights Alibaba site, if you want to order directly, they do also, I believe, um, sell them through different distributors around the world. So you might want to check them out there too. And uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed. If you have any comments or suggestions or queries around the light, please leave them in the, uh, the comment section below and we'll try to get back to you as quickly as we can. Thanks, take care.